Let's now get you a Times Network exclusive. Our team having caught the PNB scam accused Nirav Modi on the streets in London. Our reporters there having posed a number of pointed questions at this disgraced former diamond baron. He was silent on most of the questions, offering the cursory no comments to a lot of those questions, a lot of those pointed questions that continue to remain India's concern that were asked to him. Mira, tell us a little bit more. You're now subject to an arrest warrant, my friend. You're a wanted fugitive by the sounds of it. How does that make you feel? How does that make you feel, Mr. Modi? How does that make you feel? Has the situation now changed? Mr. Modi, are you Has the situation now changed, Nero? You spent a long time evading justice by the sounds of it. You're now subject to an arrest warrant. Just tell us how that makes you feel. Are you going back to India? How does that make you feel, Mr. Modi? Mr. Modi, are you planning to contact sex addiction, Mr. Modi? These, yes, are, these, are, these are very simple questions, Nira. They're very simple questions, and a lot of people, a lot of people want to know the answer. A lot of people want to know the answer to these questions, Nira. So you can run away as fast as you like. But at the end of the day... Well, no one's saying justice, but maybe it's just... Okay, fine. If you'd just like to care to say a word or two, it might help us out. And then we'll perhaps, you know, give you a chance. Give you a chance to answer for yourself. Mr. Modi, would you just like to share a word or two? Mr. Modi, are you planning to contest things? Do share a word with us. No comment. Okay. Right, well, off he goes again. Procedure on Mr. Modi now that he's gone. Would you consider sharing some, some, some thoughts on whether you're going to contest it? Okay, Mr. Modi, could you comment something? This is an opportunity for you to speak, Mr. Modi. No comment. Okay, I guess there's no point Mr. asking Modi, you what, is... what happened to the alleged billion pounds or so that appear to have gone missing. You have a red corner notice against you via Interpol. And to the best of my understanding, Nera, you've just had an arrest warrant issued against you. You're now effectively a wanted criminal. You're Mr. walking the you walk in the streets of London. Mr. How Mr. can Modi, this be? Are you, you, have you resumed can business you here? Can you explain any of this? You've resumed business here, Mr. Modi. Can you tell us a little about that? No comment. Okay. Well. But Mr. Modi, don't you do do, do share some thoughts on? What you are planning next, because there's a court process on, we believe, and there's an arrest warrant that has been issued. Are you planning to contest that? Are you planning to contest that arrest okay. warrant, Mr. Modi? Nirav, are you going to contest the extradition? Because this is obviously, as we've seen in the case of Vijay Mali and so on, it's a lengthy and protracted process. We're probably going to be seeing quite a lot of each other over the next couple of years. Do you have any feelings? Do you want to share with us what your future plans are? No comment. Okay, fine. All right, well, here's another question for you then. Your Indian passport has been revoked. Do you still carry your Belgian passport? Is, there a, is there a chance of you uh, absconding? Are you, are you working now? I, is your business up and running? Okay. Mr. Modi, is your business up and running? What visa are you working on here in the UK? <laughs> okay. There are obviously no comment is a perfectly fair answer, but you know, this doesn't look good on you. You seem very evasive. You seem to be, you know, running away from the issues, running away from the story. If you were to say anything just that would a, perhaps... Just a quick comment, Mr. Modi, whether you, so, think, whether you think... Be so good as to tell us whether, where whether, things stand. Whether you're planning to contest the proceed, extradition proceedings against you. Not comment. Okay. But surely you, surely you know there's an extradition warrant that's been issued, Mr. Modi. Are you appearing on the 25th of March, Mr. Modi? Are you appearing on the 25th of March? Are you appearing on the 25th of March, Mr. Modi? Perhaps Who are your lawyers, aside Mr. from Mr. business, Modi, then are you planning would you to care? contest the extradition proceedings, Mr. Modi? Just a very quick comment on that, sir. No comment. 
Would you care to share any thoughts with us? Simply, oh, I do beg your pardon. Some comments, please. Well, okay. Some comments, Mr. Modi. On something. Mr. Modi, you have we resumed wouldn't... business here. Could you tell us a little about that? We also understand you have a national insurance number, so you're clearly here quite legitimately. Nobody's disputing that. Just if you could share your thoughts, what you are planning next, Mr. Modi. And also, what visa are you on? What's the nature of your status here? Can you at least tell us that, Nira? Is it true that you are here on an investor visa? Do you no longer have a passport, but you're, you've no invested comment. you've invested money in the com Some comment, in the country, please, Mr. Modi. You've invested money in the country, and therefore you are yeah, Mr. Modi, you've been given leave to stay, leave to remain. We're asking you, Mr. Modi, just very simple matters that are out in the public space. Whether you are planning to contest any extradition proceedings, if you can just give us a, a, a quick comment on that. No comment. Mm. Okay. Do you have another passport, Mr. Modi? Do you, do you contemplate having not come here and going back to India? Do you contemplate that ever? Living a life hiding is not really a great thing, is it, Mr. Modi? Being trapped like this is not really good, is You're it? You're stalking me. Please stop stalking me. You're not stalking you, sir. We are trying to get answers to the questions no which you have run away from. Nero, this is just basic journalism. You're accused of having embezzled nearly a billion pounds sterling. Mm -hmm. It's a perfectly fair question. No if comment. you'd like to defend yourself, you're more than welcome. The floor is yours. This is your forum. Tell us what happened to the money. Absolutely. And if this you're an innocent man, sir. tell us more. Tell us everything you can tell us to help clear your name. This is your opportunity, Mr. Modi. Just do share some simple thoughts, Mr. Modi. On what you're planning next? No comment. Mm. Okay. Uber might work. Mm. Okay, I'm done. You're done. I'm done. Okay, well, I can't. Okay, well, it's goodbye from us for now, Nira, but I'm sure we'll be seeing you again in due course.